What is up YouTube? So today I got another special video for you guys. Uh, a few few months ago, well, it's been almost a year ago, but I ordered a Chewbacca mask from Real Time Replicas on Etsy. So I did get it probably after seven or eight months of, of waiting and uh, there it is. So today, you know, by special request uh, over on Instagram uh, by my buddy Mark, uh, he wanted me to do a close up on it and provide a review. So this is gonna be my very honest review of this this piece um, be ready for it so let's see you after the intro <coughs> all right so there so here is the Chewbacca a mask from uh, real-time replicas so real-time replicas it's a Etsy company you know I, I found it after like you know months of doing my research I did want the Regal robot one but I, I think at the time or when I was looking for this one a Regal Robot had paused on, on making some of their uh, original Chewy Bust. So I was like, okay, I still, I still wanted one. And I went out on, on the third party and looked for one. And you get what you pay for, right? Um, Etsy, there's either very good uh, creators out there making awesome stuff for the community. And then you got other ones that, they, you know, they, they do an okay job. Uh, some, sometimes overpriced. And, you know, that's where this one came in. So when I unboxed it originally, you know, I, I didn't make a video, video of it or nothing. I just took it out and then I put it up because I, I just had a, a lot of stuff, you know, not, not to brag, uh, but I had a lot of stuff waiting because of all the shipping delays. Everything decided to show up at once. So I, I teased this on Instagram, you know, I was wearing it and a lot of people were like, oh man, that's cool. So I decided to just let it sit out, you know, give it some time for it to, to take its own shape and and just get into that natural, you know, Chewbacca Wookiee look. So as you can see from from this view, right, it doesn't look too bad. Uh, the hair is, is synthetic. It's it's not made out of the, the was it the N NTF or whatever it's called. There's there's a certain synthetic hair that they use for the, the Chewbacca ones that uh, I know Regal Rollby uses and, and a lot of the other makers. But um, that material is expensive. Uh, I want to say it's it's probably like forty to seventy dollars a square foot. So, you know, if, if you're going to get one of, one of those Chewbacca masks made with that synthetic hair, you're going to be paying a lot of money. And, and that's, that's what drives a lot of these prices, right? It's, it's the type of material you use. Because the, the mask that they use underneath, is, it's simple. It only costs a couple of dollars. But what, what takes a, a lot of time and money is punching in all the hair for the mask. So, so this is a mask. It, it's not a bust. Uh, what I did is I, I bought a, a mannequin uh, head. And that's where it's sitting on. This is like a 21 inch mannequin head. And what I did is when I combed Chewy's hair, I just made sure that it like hides all that stuff. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna modify it a little bit because um, you know the, I, wanna, I wanna make it uh, stand out and pop. So that's, that's my, my intro for the piece, right? It's, so it's from Etsy, it's from Real Time Replicas. And then um, here it is displayed. So let me give you my thoughts on it. So, for, so first, uh, real-time replicas. If you go on their Etsy site, they got a lot of cool stuff. They do anything from Ninja Turtles to, um, to Chewbacca to Yodas. And if you read the reviews, it's, it's mixed reviews. Uh, there's, there's a lot of fives on there and there's a lot of twos. And then when I, when I looked at that, I, I took the risk, right? You know, I was like, man, these guys, they, they, it looks like they do good product, but at the same time, it looks like some people are, are not happy with it. Uh, they're always late. Uh, they don't communicate. And you know what? Uh, I, ex I was one of those guys that experienced the, those issues. So this whole process, I didn't realize that Etsy has a 120 day like seller or buyer protection where if, if you don't, if you're not happy with the, with the Etsy seller and you're not getting the, the support you need, Etsy will help you. But you, you have 120 days to do that. After the 120-day period, you're on your own. Uh, you can't complain about the seller. If you need a refund, they won't help you. It, it's it's a complete mess, and and, and for that, Etsy kind of sucks. Uh, I was a little pissed off about that because, as a consumer, I should be protected until I receive the product. And uh, so, the, and this is a special, you know, custom-made product. It's not going to take 120 days to do. It took these guys like seven months to to make this for me. And then when I when I got it. You know, there were some, some issues with it and, you know, I contacted the seller, never heard back, so I'm like, whatever. 
at this point, I'm just like, it is what it is, you know. I'm, I'm a little irritated about it, but it's all me, right? You, you, you buy cheap, you get cheap. So, you know, in, in Spanish, we, we have a, a saying, compras baratos, comp compra caratos. So, like, if you, if you buy cheap, you're going to keep buying because it's, it's not good quality. Uh, so, you know, this thing was like 700 bucks. Uh, I, I did some recon the other day on, on the vendors or the seller site, and the price did go down. It's, it's about 500 now. But still, I don't think I don't think this is a $500 mask. Uh, more between a two and three hundred dollar range. Uh, I, I I get it. You know they, they have to take the time to punch some of this stuff in. They have to like create the the face and and punch punch all this stuff in and glue it together. That takes time. But the, the quality of it sucks. It's just it's not that good. You know I, I was hoping for a little bit more. Uh, and let me like spin this guy around so you guys can see the back. So. So this, so this is a, a mask, right? And you would think when you're wearing a mask, you have full coverage of your, of your head. So you don't see, you know, the net or anything else. But like right here, there's, there's a lot of like missing strands. It looks like they punched some of it. They didn't punch some of it. There's a lot of gaps here. And then, you know what? I'm, and I'm, I'm stuck with this shit because Etsy doesn't help me. And then I, re I reach out to the to the people who made it, they don't freaking respond and they, they freaking suck. And what makes it uh, worse is that they're a UK based company. So even if I wanted to, to mail this back to them, it's going to cost me an arm and a leg just to get that out there and dealing with customs and taxes, you know, fuck all that. I'm not, I'm not doing that. So, so this video is for you guys just as a warning. Uh, you know, if you guys want to buy it, it's up to you. Uh, buyer beware though communication does suck um, you know the they, they post like some pretty cool pictures and I don't know if that's like a one-of-a-kind you know um, experience that I'm having but uh, like 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 I said again the the ratings and feedback on on the the seller side is hit or miss it's uh, you know from from the low end they got ones and twos from the high ends they got fives and and for me if I were to like rate this product, it's probably like like a one. Uh, the only cool thing about it is this, and that's it. Everything else sucks. You know, the the colors off. Uh, I asked for um, Empire Strikes Back uh, Chewbacca mask, and I don't know what the fuck they gave me. This this fucking thing is horrible. That's why it's hiding in the back. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna try to get to to see if some of the buddies from the the groups can help me like, make it look better. But of course, I'm going to have to pay more to get this thing fixed, which I really don't want to do. So I'm looking at different options. You know, I might, you know, uh, give it away or just, you know, sell it at, at a really cheap price to, to someone who, who wants it. You know, I'll probably just, or give it to one of my nephews. You know, they, they, they love this kind of stuff and, you know, they can play as Chewbacca. But, you know, there it is. I just want to share that, you know, this, you know, quick and simple blog or vlog since we're on videos now. Uh, just to talk about this Chewbacca mask, uh, you know, yeah, don't don't take don't take my words for you not to go buy from these guys. You know, every experience is different. I'm just sharing what my experience was with real time uh, replicas. So, uh, if if you still want to buy any of their products, it's that's all on you guys. Um, I wouldn't ever, I'm never ever buying anything again from those guys, and that's just me. You know, well, I hope you like that. Uh, like, subscribe, check out my other stuff. Um, Thanks again, and uh, may the force be with you.